hello everyone uh, welcome back to my unreal engine open world tutorial series so this is the second episode we are working on our water material and in this episode this is the problem i am going to address so as you can see here uh, this edge this looks very well it doesn't look very realistic it looks very artificial because the blend in between the landscape and the water surface is uh, quite uh, not very smooth so yeah so let's see how to fix this problem so yeah actually for that it's not very complicated so we already have implemented this uh, scene depth uh, using the scene depth we have implemented a mechanism to reduce the transparency from closer to further so in the further you do uh, everything is not transparent non-transparent so you don't see much uh, what's uh, down the water surface so but here you can see somewhat so right so here uh, instead of connecting it like this there is a node called depth fade so using this depth fade if i connect it like this well, let's just connect it like this and apply and let's wait until the shaders are compiled right now it looks like this so actually yeah this looks quite good but the problem is here we don't have any control over how much further we can uh, increase the transparency but this square looks quite good so yeah let's see what happens now if I connect this output to the opacity and also I'll promote this fade distance to a parameter the default value here was 100 so I'll put 100 there oh no uh, right uh, let's do it uh, like this let's try only with the fair distance so maybe uh, if it works perfectly we, we can get rid of this part this whole part we can get rid of that and not this one and then we can replace it with only these two let's see okay now let's try tweaking the parameters and see what happens so where's the depth fade distant right now by changing the fade distance value I can increase how further I see the transparency like this but I guess 100 is good enough and let's see how it looks from further well even from further away this edge looks uh, very yeah natural let's play the game and see it from the player's perspective right okay this looks quite good and all right okay 
I think uh, yeah we can get rid of this part because yeah because um, this looks already better without that part but uh, shall we see just just to test what would how would it look if I connect this part too okay from the distance is it looks better as before what's the difference here yeah what if i reduce this one okay so with this approach even in the distance if i want i can have transparency because I am clamping the maximum opacity like this but I don't have a such a requirement yet at the moment so if you want you can keep it and here also I can yeah I can also tweak the minimum opacity as well like this right so I'll no it shouldn't be 6 it should be 0.5 right so yeah I think I'll stop this episode at this point and yeah for the next part I want to add some forms like in this edge maybe some forms on the so later on if I can I'll try to add something like uh, some waves so, but I'm not sure how to do that yet I need to find out so right so forms and waves so that's the next part and I'll list off this episode at this point and if you like to support my work you can get the membership of my patron club link could be in the description below and depending on the tier you join you will have different privileges as I have explained here and also I'll release uh, I'll release the project files for this with this uh, updated material code in through patron and link would be in the description below and thanks for watching see you in the next episode goodbye